will not. You got another referee, but that will not be a match. We will not have Sonny King as a referee. Or he just fought with the bell. Bring us the bell right now. Sonny King will never be the referee. Both, both referees. Nice shot of Grizzly Smith, ladies and gentlemen, of uh, Just a minute, Reed. This is for the North American title. You're not gonna wrestle. Matchmaker you Grizzly you. Smith and Ernie Ladd. Discussion here, wrestling fans, with regard to Sonny King being named special referee for this match between Hexar Butch Reed and Magnum TA. Butch Reed and Ernie Ladd complaining that Sonny King is biased. Matchmaker Grizzly Smith now having some words with Sonny King. Grizzly Smith now telling the fans that he will be getting a replacement referee for Sonny King. It's a good shot there of Hacksaw Butch Reed and Big Cat Ernie Ladd and Magnum T.A. Special referee alongside him, Sonny King. Magnum T.A., the North American heavyweight champion at this time. That has to show you how big Big Cat Ernie Ladd was at that time because Hacksaw Butch Reed was no, was no cruiserweight himself. Ernie the Cat Ladd towering over everyone at, uh, in that ring at the time. Hacksaw Butch Reed now standing up on that top, on that first turnbuckle. But um, obviously an issue between Hacksaw Butch Reed, Ernie Ladd, and Sonny King because they are objecting to him being the referee for this match and are refusing to compete until Sonny King is replaced. Well, let's hope whoever Grizzly Smith gets as the replacement meets the standards of Big Ernie Ladd and Hacksaw Butch Reed. Well, this match is for all the marbles. And for the North American Heavyweight Championship. Magnum TA was just uh, reaching his prime at this point. Shortly after um, this was taped, he Ladies moved over to the Mid-Atlantic Territory. And the new referee, ladies and gentlemen, introduced as Jose Lothario. Ernie Ladd now agreeing to accept Jose Lothario as the new referee. He said, From Kansas City, Missouri, the challenger, Hacksaw Butch Reed. In his corner tonight, ladies and gentlemen, as his ring advisor, Big Ernie Ladd. His opponent weighs 235 pounds from Virginia Beach, Virginia. The North American heavyweight champion, Magnum T.A. Now, as you heard Ernie Ladd, er, as you heard Ernie Ladd say that Jose Lothario won't be biased, so clearly he trusts Jose Lothario more than he trusts Sonny King. Apparently, so is a good shot of that North American heavyweight championship belt. Magnum T.A. really in his prime at this uh, point in his career. Shortly after this, he uh, went to the Mid-Atlantic Territory and was a, a candidate for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship before being involved in a very tragic car accident that ended his career. But this is a good shot of Magnum T.A. and Hacksaw Butchery. Look at the physique 
on Hacksaw Butch Reed. Both of these competitors have a tremendous physique. Now you talk about Magnum TA being in his prime. Now you just mentioned the wonderful physique of Hacksaw Butch Reed. Now it seems very clear that Hacksaw Butch Reed also seemed to be in the, in the prime of his career at this point. Absolutely. Both wrestlers now. Butch Reed with some words for the ringside fans, showing his confidence, that brashness, cockiness. Butch Reed not short on the charisma department. Both men sizing each other up. Good collar and elbow tie up. So it seems like both gentlemen didn't seem to get the better of one another. Hopefully the next time around. Here you go, another beautiful collar and elbow tie up. There's he Butch Reed taking down Magnum TA. TA with a beautiful counter. Another single leg takedown and another takedown by Magnum TA. Beautiful drop kick by Magnum TA. Referee Jose Lothario watching closely as Butch Reed now goes to the outside of the ring. Not something Butch Reed expected to see. There you see his ring advisor, Big Cat Ernie Ladd, advising Butch Reed to not to rush things, to take his time. Because remember, ladies and gentlemen, this is for the North American Heavyweight Championship. A lot at stake here. And now this time, Hacksaw gets the advantage, working that left arm of Magnum TA. And when you got somebody the size of Butch Reed working any part of your body, it is not a good thing. Hard right forearm smashed by Magnum TA and an arm drag takedown. Has Hacksaw Butch Reed in trouble. And just like that, the North American heavyweight champion just working on the left arm of Hacksaw Butch Reed. Magnum is showing Butch Reed why he is the current North American heavyweight champion here in this matchup. Fans here squarely behind the very popular Magnum TA as he works on that left arm of Hacksaw Butch Reed. And the crowd is just sorely behind Magnum TA. Now Big Cat Ernie Ladd has got to be worried about his guy at this point. And now Butch Reed fighting back with some forearms of his own. Big scoop and a big slam, but Magnum TA does not let go of that left arm. Look at the tenacity of Magnum TA as he continues to hang on to that left arm. Referee Jose Lothario asking Hacksaw Butch Reed if he wants to submit. Magnum TA having the wrestling advantage over Butch Reed. Relentlessly working over that left arm, dropping his entire weight onto that shoulder and upper bicep. There we had a good shot of referee Jose Lothario, a huge Texas legend, has trained so many, so many great wrestlers, including the heartbreak kid Shawn Michaels. Jose Lothario having some really phenomenal matches himself throughout the years here in the state of Texas and throughout the, the world, actually. Hard right hand by Butch Reed has Magnum TA staggered on the ropes. Irish rip to the ropes. Ducking a fist. Huge leapfrog by Butch Reed, followed by another beautiful drop kick by the North American champion. Phenomenal agility shown by Magnum TA. Another beautiful arm drag takedown. And he goes right back to that point of attack. That left arm and shoulder. Well, so far it's been working for Magnum TA, so I don't I don't uh, blame Magnum for going back to that well. Magnum moving into a top wrist lock now. Hacksaw Butch Reed trying to fight back with a little um, underhanded tactics there, grabbing a handful of hair. Magnum now to his feet, working on that top wrist lock. If you notice, Magnum is on his feet, Butch Reed is on his knees, so that position allows him to apply a lot of pressure to that shoulder. Now, 
That's why Butch Reed now coming to his feet to try to counteract that. And moving, now, moving into almost a test of strength type uh, position here. Aha, Butch Reed now with a little shortcut there. And now it's the challenger that's getting the best of the champion. For Reed, Jose Lothario asking Butch Reed if he pulled the hair. Butch Reed telling him no. And now it's Butch Reed in control with that top wrist lock. And now the challenger is just driving, using all of his body weight on Magnum TA. And Magnum TA with that beautiful bridge trying to reverse it. Phenomenal neck strength for that bridge. As Magnum TA now made with a phenomenal bridge up to his feet. Butch Reed now still with that top wrist lock. Magnum TA trying to find his way out. Butch not letting up. The Magnum TA also not letting up. And, and it's Magnum TA with a beautiful reversal. Magnum TA now working on that left arm again. Hard knee to the upper bicep and shoulder of Hacksaw Butch Reed. Butch Reed in pain here. Being given the pain by the champion. Of course, the champion trying to wear down his opponent. Of course, in professional wrestling, you can win by pin, submission, or disqualification. Of course, count out as well. Of course, winning a pin, winning by pinfall, winning by disqualification or count out does not mean the title will change hands. So clearly it's gotta be by pinfall or submission. Well it's gotta be pinfall or submission by Butch Reed if Butch Reed wants to walk away the North American heavyweight champion. Absolutely correct. And the champion, Magnum TA, now really taking this match to the challenger. Butch Reed now, hard boot to the midsection. He's got the champion in the ropes. Oh, Shoulder nice. smashed by Magnum TA. Oh, an amazing hard right knee by Hacksaw Butch Reed. That was some beautiful agility being shown by Hacksaw Butch Reed. Wow, crashing that knee into the face of the champion, Magnum TA. Referee Jose Lothario checking. Magnum TA damn near knocked out on that one. Well, I will, I will give Big Ernie Ladd credit. Jose Lothario hasn't shown any kind of bias during this entire matchup. So I guess Grizzly Smith knows how to pick his referees. That's a Butch Reed now, now on the attack. Oklahoma Whoa. Stampede type maneuver by Hacksaw Butch Reed. Driving go, Magnum covered. TA space into that mat. Oh, and, and it's not over. Magnum TA count with a of, kick out. Count of two by Jose Lothario. Magnum TA barely kicks out of that pin. Now Magnum TA is on the ropes now. And a beautiful, oh my goodness, beautiful, literally on the ropes. Beautiful hot shot maneuver by Butch Reed. Butch Reed dropping Magnum TA throat first over that top rope. That can severely damage and crush that larynx. Magnum TA in trouble now on the canvas. Here we go, Butch Reed setting up for a huge neck breaker. Reverse neck breaker by Hacksaw Butch Reed. There we go. Going in for a pin one, two. Oh. Hacksaw Butch Reed now very unhappy as the champion kicks out of the count of two. And then the champion is showing tremendous heart and tremendous determination here in this matchup. Butch Reed now driving Magnum TA's head into that canvas. I wonder what kind of advice Big Ernie Ladd is going to have for his charge here right now. And now Magnum TA sent to the ringside floor by Hacksaw Butch Reed. Referee Jose Lothario. Magnum's got to be careful because Ernie Ladd is right next to him. Making the count now. Ernie Ladd on the ringside floor now. As we pointed earlier, the title cannot change hands via count out. So... Ernie well, Ladd getting very close to Magnum TA now. But Ernie Ladd is keeping his distance. I'll give him that. And Butch Reed now with a headbutt. Well, as a challenger, I would think Butch Reed would want to get Magnum back in the ring if he really wants to win this championship. 
Agnantia now trying to get back into the ring. Gamely trying to return to this match. It looks like Butch Reed is going to bring him in the hard way, if you know what I mean. And a beautiful suplex back into the ring by Butch Reed. And now Hacksaw signifying that this is going to be over. Two. And another kick out by the champion. Hacksaw has got to be wondering, what else do I got to do to Magnum TA to make me the North American champion? So Butch Reed now with a front face lock, trying to restrict the breathing of the champion, continue to tire him out. Well, he's done a great job of that so far with that guillotine choke to the larynx. Classic wrestling maneuver here, ladies and gentlemen. And what I like about this one is that not only does he have his arms around the throat, but he has one of Magnum TAs restricted, making him very less likely to break out of it. He's forcing Magnum TA to carry his weight, uh, but this is also a, a sleeper type maneuver as well. You can, and now and I, Butch Reed getting a little, extra, a little extra leverage there, the foot on the bottom rope. Jose Lothario didn't see that. Lothario now checking. And once again, Butch Reed is using those ropes for leverage. But once again, breaks out of it as, as soon as Jose Lothario checks on him. Jose Lothario now breaking the hold, having some words with Hacksaw Butch Reed. Magnum PA now trying to catch his breath. Butch Reed cannot waste any time. He has to keep on the champion and finish him as quickly as possible if he has any kind of chance to walk out the new North American heavyweight champion. Four hard right hands by Hacksaw Butch Reed had it Magnum TA by the hair. And Magnum TA has clearly got those Krispy Kreme glazed look in his eye. Butch Reed now with a rear chin lock on Magnum TA. Once again, having Magnum TA to forcefully carry the weight of Hacksaw Butch Reed. Match now probably deep into the 20 minute mark. Both wrestlers. And Magnum TA is fading here. Jose the third row checking that arm. If it goes down three times, Butch Reed will be the new North American champion. But no, Butch Reed, but no, uh, Magnum TA is valiantly, valiantly fighting back. Both wrestlers now feeling the effects of fatigue, no doubt. But Magnum TA responding to the cheers of the crowd, getting his second win. There you see Magnum TA, there you see Magnum getting his strength back, trying to put down Butch Reed, but Butch Reed fighting back himself. And yeah. Butch Reed goes for the tights. Again, Butch Reed with that illegal shortcut. Illegal or not, it was effective. Referee asking Butch Reed if he uh, pulled those tights. And of course, Butch Reed is going to say no, he didn't. Reed now again working on Magnum TA. And once again, Magnum TA is fading, and again, Jose Lothario is checking that arm. Very effective rear chin lock. Oh. And again, Magnum TA keeps coming back, no matter how much punishment Butch Reed is delivering. Magnum TA now fighting his way to his feet. Well, let's hope this works for Magnum TA this time. There you go, some elbows to the gut. And again, Butch Reed with a head full of hair. Well, it was kind of hard to see from our vantage point what Butch Reed did. Referee Jose Lothario breaking the hole. Magnum TA is still in trouble. The champion now on the defensive. Butch Reed now doing his best to wear him down. Again, the referee checking to see. Oh, oh that was close. To, that was close that time. Magnum TA close to unconsciousness. Now I have no idea what, how Magnum TA keeps coming back from all this punishment. Amazing resiliency on the part of Magnum TA showed you just why. He was such a superstar that he was. Shoulder smash. Knocks Butch Reed to the canvas. Here we go, beautiful sunset flip. Here we go, one. 
Sunset flip by Magnum TA to the ropes. Another shoulder tackle. But Both Ma wrestlers now crashing their heads together. Double knockout. And there you see big Ernie Ladd trying to get his guy to wake up first. Jose Lothario now making the count. Now, if both men get counted out, it will end in a draw, and Magnum will retain the North American Heavyweight Championship. Reed now fighting his way to his feet. Magnum TA tried to shake those cobwebs free. Hard right hand to the gut. And a hard right hand by Butch Reed. And Hacksaw Butch Reed goes to the eyes. And there you see Magnum blocking a shot. And Magnum just rams Butch Reed's head into that turnbuckle. Reversing that turnbuckle. And a hard, hard right hand of his own. And Magnum TA now. Once again, Mag uh, Butch Reed goes for the eyes. Butch Reed now to desperation move. Has Magnum TA in the turnbuckle. Irish rip at the turnbuckle. Clothesline by Butch Reed. And now, once again, for some more. Johnson, another Irish rip to the ropes. Ducking that fist. Oh, and a beautiful flying forearm by Magnum TA. Magnum TA getting his second win here. Feeding off this energy by this amazing crowd. Hard right hand by Magnum TA. Again, this has been a slugfest. And another oh. beautiful drop kick by Magnum TA. Has Hacksaw Butch Reed stunned. There you go, Magnum has got to go for the finish here. But Butch Reed, the challenger, not letting up. Both of these wrestlers fighting toe to toe in the center of the ring here, fans. There we go, Irish rip reversal. Going for hip toss, Magnum reverses with a hip toss of his own. This is not sports entertainment wrestling fans. This is professional wrestling as it needs to be, as it used to be, and as it will be in the future. There you go, some shots there by Magnum TA. Irish rip to the ropes. And a beautiful belly to belly suplex, but no, the referee is out. Referee Jose Lothario. There you Unfortunately, go. Unfortunately, and Ernie Ladd on the ring apron, catching a forearm by Magnum TA. I don't know what's going to happen here, ladies and gentlemen. There you see a hip toss by Magnum TA. And Magnum TA missing with a drop kick. Didn't get all of that drop kick, but he got some. Magnum TA now fighting on adrenaline alone. Jose Lothario now back on his wait, feet. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. It looks like Ernie Ladd just gave Butch Reed something. Ernie Ladd now passing Butch Reed a foreign object. Well, whatever it was, he just knocked out Magnum TA with it. Wait, we got to cover one, two. We get a three count. And Jose Lothario making the count, ladies and gentlemen, the winner. And oh. the new North American heavyweight champion, Hacksaw Butch Reed. Wait, wait a minute. Wait, hold on. Whatever, whatever Butch Reed was hiding. And Jose Lothario has reversed the decision. Butch Reed now nails the referee. He nailed him with that object that Ernie Ladd gave, gave to him. In a reverse decision, Magnum TA has been declared the winner. However, Butch Reed and Magnum, Magnum now making a comeback on Ernie Ladd and Magnum dumping Ernie Ladd or trying to dump Ernie Ladd over that top rope. Heck, saw Butch Reed now catching Magnum TA in the back of the head. And now Butch Reed is going after and Jose Lothario with some shots of his own. And a hip toss by the legendary Jose Lothario. And Jose Lothario now with that foreign object that was passed to Hacksaw Butch Reed by Big Cat Ernie Ladd. It looks like brass knuckles, Jeremy. And there's a good shot of that North American championship belt being returned to Magnum TA. His hand being raised in the air by special referee. Jose Lothario.